But if there are for those who disagree with this report, tell us why you disagree. Let's pass go with the members. I will come back to you, the members. It was a directive from Deputy Speaker Jacob Olanya that the Public Service and Local Governments Committee meets. The objective was to harmonize divergent views on the report on mismanagement of Kampala Capital State Authority. As even the President, they are giving a recommendation that the President should take over Kampala, take over from, who? They, they, they are from to, himself. Are going to debate. No, no, that's very wrong. Good views that that's very wrong. wrong. Yeah, because the President is himself is in charge of Kampala City. Continue fooling now he is taking over from who? It's not a local government. But this meeting failed to agree on a way forward as the chairperson of the committee, Florence King, to fail to produce the minutes on which the committee based its recommendation. That if we are to harmonize on this report, let's have the minutes together. I look at the minutes, I see why, how you arrived at this, this, this recommendation, and I can dissent or I can say that is, in, in, in fact, that is, that, I agree with that. This angered some of the MPs and the meeting soon degenerated into a verbal exchange. And it is very bad to send someone. Order, order, order. We are members of this committee. We are not here to be intimidated by them to your person. I don't allow you when you tell me. I will also not allow you. But you don't listen to us. I will not allow you. This is your house. It's not my house. So let me submit. So since you have asked me to go and hang, I'm not going to allow you to say anything. I will not allow you to say anything. Order, order. I chair this committee. Order, and those, those methods that you are using are not going to, to help you at all. By coming here and abusing, and abusing us, being stupid, really that doesn't make sense. We are going to do this work today. I'm here to clarify that this is not the house. We are going to do this work today, Mr. Honorable Toe. And nothing, not even your abusive words, will stop us from handling this business. The committee chairperson had to adjourn the meeting for 15 minutes to allow tempers cool, but even outside the committee, tempers continued to flare. Into substance, do you have a problem with the report? Bring your views. We have a problem with the minutes. Oh, then you must have attended the meeting. You should have attended that meeting. Yeah. Yeah. Why are you not producing the minutes that the MPs are asking yes. for? Because this is not the terms of reference of this meeting. What is the terms this of This meeting of is here to harmonize. Uh, the, to harmonize the report with the dissenting views. views. How, how, how you on the basis of what? We harmonize <laughs> by listening <laughs> to <laughs> the dissenting <laughs> views. You're what about the minutes? You are, you are saying... The committee later resumed its meeting, but the members could not reach a decision. The vice chairperson, Rafael Magues, moved a motion to suspend the meeting. Mm. But having been here for a specific assignment to receive the dissenting views of the honorable members, Aware that we have been here for quite some time, yeah, including an adjournment, and that we are back and we have not received any substantive presentation. Mm. I'd like to move the motion that you now close our meeting. Under which rule? Under which rule? Under which rule? You have just come in and you have come in with a motion. You have come in with a motion. <laughs> he was he was he was he was he was no, he was around. The dissenting MPs could not agree with this. And another outburst soon erupted. Okay. Our members, I hereby close the meeting. No, I don't know. 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 No, I don't you might be arrogant because you have the majority today, but this is our country. I have a share in this country. I'm not here as an imposter. I don't know what must have happened. Something wrong somewhere happened. And I think we need to, we need, we need to, you know, we need to keep our integrity. So even, even when you look at the numbers, it's not about the numbers each and every time you think we have numbers in the house so you can pass any stupid thing for this Madam country Chair, because you have numbers. It's very really wrong. Madam Chair, we want to discuss a meeting. No, you can't come sit here to discuss when you have disrupted the meeting. I'm ready to be suspended from Parliament. Yeah. I've been respecting you people. 
You can't carry on political fraud in broad daylight. You can't do this. What's your problem? The Mukona Municipality MP, who is the lead petitioner, could not contain the action of the chairperson, Florence Kintu. If you don't follow the rules, then no one will follow the rules. I can't even keep it. <laughs> <laughs> Agnes Nandutu, NTV, Parliament. <laughs> <laughs>